hello guys and welcome to another video and another vlog i hope you're all doing really well so i am in a little bit of a rush because i'm leaving today to go for a meeting um not really a meeting it's more just like a nice lunch with my manager and pen hannigans which i'm so excited for because they're my favorite brand the girl who works there is so lovely so it's gonna just be a really nice chilled lunch so i'm gonna take you guys along with me here's my outfit today i'm wearing a new look trench coat and other stories tee zara trousers uh, trainers are from Everlane and my bag is from Louis Vuitton. <laughs> Good morning guys, it's now the next day, I'm just getting ready and I've popped in my rollers because since I've had my hair cut and it's a quite a bit shorter, I can't style it the same and I've just been using a lot more heat on it than I normally would so I just thought if I rollered it at least it will dry nice and smooth. I'm actually not doing anything today but... I just feel so much better about myself when I've got like nice hair. And there we go. It's not perfect, but definitely better than nothing. Now I need to quickly finish off my makeup. For lip liner, I'm going to wear my Rimmel in Tiramisu. And for gloss, I'm going to use my iconic London Hyaluronic. I think this is their Hyaluronic gloss. It's like an oil. It's really lovely. Oh, and my gown is from the Napco. It's from their new collection. How cute is it? I've just been loving wearing this whilst getting ready and stuff um i have this one and my lily silk one kind of like on rotation so really really excitingly i got my dream brand collaboration the other day um if you've followed me for a while you'll definitely know who this is but i've always wanted to work with them and i'm finally working with them so i'm just making my selects for the brand now to send over for what i'm going to post in um but yeah, I can't wait to show you guys. I know you all love this brand just as much as I do. So that'll be on my Instagram over the next couple of weeks, I think. Afternoon, guys. I've just been doing some editing and stuff like that. And I've also just tried some um, Amazon fashion bits I ordered on. So I thought I'd do a little haul for you guys. And there's some really, really nice bits here. Um, I also ordered some like accessories and shoes and stuff like that for the summer. I'm going to start off with this bra because I always get so many questions about what bra to wear with the Zara bodysuits and I always wear this one. It's either this one or the stick on one, um, which I'll also link down below. This is from an Amazon brand called Iris and Lily and they just have really nice like pajamas and underwear and stuff like that. And it's just such a nice, comfortable, strapless bra. It also has the options to add straps on if you want to, but um, I just wear it as a strapless and it's really nice. It's obviously not the most sexy lingerie, but it's very functional. Um, so yeah, it's just really handy. I picked up some more underwear from them. I always just love a good black pair of underwear. It's like my go-to, so I thought I'd order something there. I just really like the shape of these ones. These are just like thongs, um, and they kind of have this V shape to them. Um, I don't know if you able to see. Yeah, as you can see, it's like a nice V, and they're really soft, really good quality. Um, again, just a really nice kind of basic in the underwear drawer. And it comes in a pack of three. And then I also picked up these shoes here. And as you can see, they're very similar to the Hermes Oran um, sandal. And I just really like this style. I just think it's so simple and so classic. And it's just going to go with so many summer outfits. So I picked up these in black. And also I picked them up in white as well because, because yeah i just really like them i can see myself wearing these so much in the summer um they are really i haven't worn them out yet i've worn them around the house and they are very comfortable they've got a nice bit of like padding on the sole so it's not like that really hard like shapeless sole to them and also the leather isn't like a hard leather either so i think these would be a good kind of everyday shoe in the summer i also picked up a pair of shoes from the drop which is like amazon's influencer collaboration kind of brand um and i saw these and these just reminded me so much of some chanel shoes oh my god i just i just love these so much i think they're so elegant and just so timeless and just yeah really great kind of chanel vibes i just really feel like wearing these will just make any outfit look so sophisticated and just that little bit more glam as well as they have the pointed toe and just this really nice little heel so very excited to wear these i also saw that naked is it 
naked or n-a-k-d i don't know naked fashion is now on amazon and i've actually never purchased from them before but i feel like they're a really popular brand over on instagram and they've also collaborated with some really nice influencers that i follow so i thought i'd give them a go via amazon so i picked up these jeans here and these are their mum style jeans and i've just tried them on and i'm so impressed with them i really really love the fit they're very tapered and they do come in quite a bit at the ankle, which I really like, especially with mum jeans. I often have to get mine tailored to do that. I think it's just where I have like quite small ankles, I guess. But um, yeah, I just thought these were really flattering. And I really like the colour as well. I don't actually have jeans in this colour. This like dark blue wash colour. Weirdly, it says that these are a size 10 and I'm normally a size 6 in jeans. I definitely didn't order a size 10, but they fit really well. So I don't really know what's going on there. But yeah, either way they fit. So that's the main thing. I'm definitely going to be keeping these. I feel like in previous Amazon fashion hauls, I've shown you guys the Levi 501s. And I have them in like a grey, a blue and a black. And I really love them. So I thought I'd try out the shorts. Um, so I picked up this really nice like pale blue wash colour. And I'm really sad that I don't like these on. I mean, off they look lovely, but on they just don't suit me at all. Like they're just a bit, I feel like they're almost a bit low and wide and I just prefer shorts to be really high waisted. Um, but yeah, these just weren't flattering on me at all. So I will be taking these back, which is a shame as I definitely feel like I've seen other girls wearing these and they just looked so good as they have that really like vintage Levi's vibe. But yeah, they're just not for me. So these will be going back. And then another thing I picked up is this beautiful striped shirt. I'll show you the fabric close up as you can see it's a nice stripe and it's just this really lovely like brushed cotton almost really soft like really lovely and lightweight so good for summer and i just thought this was such a classic looking shirt this is from a brand called daily ritual it almost has that like dad style feel to it and i really liked the way it looked on as well it just has that really casual cozy feel to it um and the great thing about shirts as well is that there's so many different ways you can wear them um i'll put a video up on the screen that i did on my instagram um just showing different ways you can wear a shirt but they're just really versatile so i'm always looking out for like nice shirts and stuff whenever i do a bit of a shop and really happy with this one um what else did i get i'm sure i've got something else so yeah i also got some jewelry and they actually have such a wide selection of jewelry and a lot of it's like 18 karat gold plated it's really affordable so i picked up this beautiful like flat, what is it, like a snake necklace almost? Flat chain. But I just thought this was so nice and just a really nice like layering piece. And this is only £18 and it's 18 karat gold plating with like a stainless steel underneath. So I doubt this is gonna tarnish. But it seems really good quality as well. So I thought this was really cute. And the last thing I purchased, I cannot find anywhere and it's been driving me mad. But I basically purchased these little like, they're, they're almost hooks and they're basically bag chain adjusters because with my two YSL bags the chain is really long and I saw that you can actually adjust your bags with these little things I'll pop a picture up on the screen and it just means you can shorten the train or you can like make the chain into a handle or stuff like that um but I cannot find them for the life of me so if I can find them I'll show you later on in this vlog but yeah that's everything I picked up and I just feel like Amazon fashion is really underrated because it's so handy having the prime with it so it literally comes the next day and there's so many really great brands and there's also some really nice like Amazon owned brands that have these really gorgeous pieces like that shirt I showed you guys earlier. So definitely check them out and I'll link everything that I showed you guys down below. Hello again guys, um, I've just received some more Amazon deliveries. This isn't fashion though, this is just stuff I ordered myself. Today's been such a write off, you know, like I know I mentioned it in my last video that I've been quite ill and there's nothing wrong with me, I'm just, I think I'm just run down. And I thought I had got rid of it but I'm not feeling great today so it's been a bit of a write-off and I've just been spending the last couple of hours in bed but I just find that whenever I'm in bed and I'm just resting I just get the worst guilt ever and I feel so bad when I'm not like vlogging or I'm not taking photos or I'm not working basically like the guilt is so real. Anyway I'm going to show you guys what I got I've got some storage bits because let me show you in here I've got like loads of beauty and makeup bits um like spares almost so in here i've got things that um i've already got so i don't need two of so either i'm like saving it or I'm gonna give it away in like an instagram giveaway or give away to friends family but they're currently in these like ikea boxes which are just so um not ideal and like i can't see what i've got so i bought some acrylic boxes oh my 
love these. They're exactly what I wanted. So they are these acrylic drawers. They're actually meant for shoes. And yeah, they're just really cool. Oh, I love them. Okay, let's fill these up. Okay, so I got four in total. Um, just to like see if they were any good. I didn't want to spend lots of money on loads if they weren't good. And I think they're around like £15 each or something. And I'm definitely going to do another giveaway soon with like beauty bits and stuff because no girl needs like 20 blushes and I'm thinking I must have about 20 blushes here. So I do them on my Instagram sometimes, um, like on stories and stuff. So keep your eyes peeled for that. Guys, how cute are these pixie face masks? They're like ice cream tubs and they come with a little spoon. I haven't opened these yet though because I've actually got um, a couple of face masks that I've already opened that I've already opened and I always get worried that things are gonna go out of date. So I don't want to have lots of things open at once. But these are just adorable. I'm definitely give one of these away. Okay, so here's where we're at. In here, I've got like face stuff. So I've got like my Ren tonic in there, like some face oils, face masks, face washes. Um, in this bit, I've got some beauty bits. In here, I've got like body bits. So like, um, I've got dental floss as well. I don't know why that's in there. But yeah, like moisturizers and washes and stuff like that. And then in this box, I'm gonna keep all of my hair and tan. Um, so I've got lots of my favourite brands in there. So yeah, I'm going to now put these into the cupboard and I hope they fit. I did measure it, so they should. They fit perfectly. Oh, that's really good. Okay, so now that this is looking so much better, this is so satisfying. Um, I can see everything, I can access everything, um, and it's just so easy. So I've got my makeup bits in here, skincare bits there, and kind of like random bits that I think I'm gonna run out of soon in here, and body in here. And they're just so easy to pull out and access, so I'm definitely gonna order more of these because they're really handy. I actually received these hourglass stick blushes in the post earlier and they are incredible but they sent me quite a lot so um i thought i'd put some in here to save or we'll give away uh, i'll do a quick swatch actually so here's it swatched in the shade wonder look how pretty the packaging is and everything it's really beautiful it's like a creamy consistency but it kind of almost goes to like a powder once it's on the skin i'm also very stocked up on moisturizers and body bits uh, i've got some of my penhaligans um, this is the Babylon hand wash and then the Babylon um, moisturizer as well. This is what I have in my bathroom. I think it's an impressor at the moment though. I've also got a Pixi Rose Cleanser, which smells amazing too. This Elemis massage oil, which is so nice. I've also put like some mini things in here, like um, mini Elemis day cream if I can get it there we go yeah this is a hydro day cream which is really good but I like to keep the mini things for like when I go traveling if that will ever happen again anyway it's now coming up to five o'clock so getting near the end of the day and I need to tidy up all of the mess that I have made on the floor just now um I've got a big box of recycling in the middle there and just like loads of random bits and bobs so I'll put you guys on a time lapse I'm about to hop in the bath and it just reminded me I actually purchased some more random bits off Amazon. I am actually obsessed. So I bought this glass squeegee, not a glass squeegee, a, a glass squeegee, a glass squeegee? You know what I mean. And it has like a hook so you can attach it to the shower because at the moment I've got like this ugly plastic one that just kind of rests there. So now I can like hang it up and it'll be great. Because yeah, I always squeegee after I shower because I hate any like watermarks and stuff. It drives me insane. And then I also picked up some more of these like loofah things because they're just the best 
for exfoliating and I thought these match my bathroom. Um, very boring grey colour but at least they all match. Such a boring thing to get excited over but look how snazzy it is. Oh you get two hooks I think, that's kind of cool. So you get like this see through one and there's like a chrome one as well. I think I'm going to go for the chrome one because it matches the shower. Okay and then for the grand reveal, look, I think that looks so snazzy, I love that. Just looks like it's meant to be there. So now after my showers, I can just, you know, squeegee away. B, yeah. look at my new squeegee. B's just got back from oh, work. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's need, so nice. I knew you'd appreciate it. Oh my God, my hair. <laughs> it's huge. B's back from work. She hasn't been in the vlog because you're a working gal again. Yeah. No more furlough. Oh, I love that. Whatever happened to that? Oh, it's just really annoying. Oh, really? Um, I got like this hard water filter thing and it's just really heavy and really annoying so I took it off. Really, really nice. It's so cute, isn't it? Yeah. You can borrow. It's, it's No, I just mean for work. It's really stretchy, definitely for your boobs. I got these extra bits from Free People after my haul, guys. There's this really cute top and this like loungewear set. Also, how cute is my octopus? I've got this thing with octopuses at the moment. I love them. Have you watched The Octopus's Teacher? I think it's called that. On Netflix. That's why I'm obsessed with them. It's a documentary on Netflix about octopuses. They're quite, they're, they, yeah, I'm not a massive fan. Watch a documentary, it'll change your mind. Really? It's really nice, yeah. Yeah, they freak me out a bit. They're like spiders. Yeah, they used to freak me out a bit, but um, no longer. morning guys it is now thursday um i went on instagram this morning and two people said it was friday and i was so confused but it's definitely thursday i've just got ready because i'm gonna go into central london and do a bit of shopping um i'm gonna meet b for lunch do some returns for today's perfume i'm gonna wear cairo by pen hannigans um this is such a like an oody deep rich smell it's just so beautiful it's also got like notes of vanilla one of my favourites, it's very strong though. Hello, I'm at Bee on her lunch break. Hi. And we're just taking some outfit photos of the shirt I showed you guys yesterday. Um, the light's really like grey and it's above as well, so it's not... Um, yeah, it's really overcast today. Yeah, it's not great, but these are the ones we've got so far. Okay, now I'm taking photos of Bee in this really cute nasty girl dress. Oh, getting in everyone's way. Oh, close, really close, yeah? Yes, please. Oh yeah, these are really nice. Very pretty. I think I prefer the close. Well, the close is going to go first anyway. Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. laughing at me then. <laughs> oh, no. I think I fancy Prex. I think I fancy Soup. Okay. I'm going to go into that one. So we've done our photos, and we're just going to get some lunch. <laughs> like... I'm just in H&M looking at their summer bits. Some really nice things. I also just popped into Zara, but everything is so colourful. And although I love that trend, I think it's nice on other people. It's just not for me. So um, H&M's a lot more neutral, so I'm enjoying this a bit more. I love this dress. It's like a really nice linen-y material. Um, so cute, actually. And it's only $17.99. I've also got this really cute little crop top that would look amazing with like some high-waisted mum jeans. These jeans here are also super cute. I love these. They're like straight leg with this little rip on the knee. So Mango have these really cute trousers. They're like these chino style. I like them. So I love this bag. Very Fendi vibes. Super cute. They also have this cardigan, which is like a nice linen. So I think it's going to look really gorgeous over like summer outfits, so I actually might pick this up. They've also got some matching trousers as well, which is quite cute. So you also have like these linen yogurt style trousers that I love. These would be 
such a comfortable everyday trouser. They also come in like this nice sand colour. I also love this like vest and this long knit v-neck kind of tank top with cute tie. Have a look. This blazer is also really nice. I absolutely love the colour of this. Really cute. So I'm home now and I actually didn't buy anything. I found the shops quite underwhelming just a lot of it really wasn't my style but i've just come home to a really nice delivery so i'm gonna open it on camera with you guys from ghd and it is their rise volumizing hot brush so i'm very very excited about this i can't wait to use it i feel like this is gonna be really great i've been looking at loads of tutorials of people using this and it looks really really good so very excited to try this i'll definitely have to do like a tutorial or something they also sent some aurelia london bits and i currently use their cbd serum which is incredible so i'm very excited to try these other bits as well i've got some day oil some night oil and also a cleanser and then I've also got this really exciting parcel from MAC. So this is the Lord & Lux MAC collection, which is just such a good collaboration. Like, so happy for her to get such an amazing collaboration. A really lovely handwritten note. Oh wow, this bag is so nice. It's like this leather pouch. Jay's one hundred is quite hard. So I think you get all of this in the pouch and it's worth over £100, but altogether it's 75 and it comes with some Fix Plus Absolute Holy Grail and lipstick. Oh, it's got Lorna's name on it. That's incredible. Like, imagine having your name on a MAC lipstick. Wow. Oh, that's such a beautiful colour. It's like a nice pinky rose colour. Also got some plumping lip gloss. It's a really nice blush. It's like a nice kind of shimmery um, brownie nude, which is lovely. Oh, and then an eyeliner as well. Oh, I love this eyeliner. I've actually got this. I think this was the first thing I ever purchased from MAC when I was a lot younger. So this is really exciting. I've just popped on the MAC lip gloss and lipstick that was in the Lorna Luxe kit. And it's really nice, it's a beautiful combo. Anyway, I think I'm gonna just chill for the rest of the evening, have some dinner, watch Sex in the City. I was on such a roll with it. I was like obsessed in the last lockdown. But then whenever Bee's here, I don't really watch TV. Um, I only watch it when I'm on my own. So I've kind of stopped with it. But Bee's out this evening. So I'm gonna have a bit of a Sex in the City marathon. So yeah, I'm gonna end this vlog here. Thank you so much for watching guys. And I will see you in my next video. I love you all so, so, so much. Bye.